we see a variety of plants in our surroundings at home, school, playground, etc. All these plants look different from each other, but they have many parts in common, like all of them have roots, leaves, stem, and some have buds and flowers as well. Out of all these parts, one part is very important for the survival of plants. This part is also known as the kitchen of the plant or we can call it as food factory because it helps in preparing food for the plant. By now, you would have guessed that I am talking about leaf. Yes. So students, today we are going to start our first chapter, the leaf. What is leaf? Leaf is a thin, flattened, green part of the plant that is attached to the stem or a branch. They are usually green because of the presence of green pigment called chlorophyll. You must have observed that all leaves are different from each other. They have different shapes, size, etc. But their basic structure is same. So today we are going to study the parts of a leaf. For your reference, you can take one leaf from your garden. Now leaf has a short cylindrical stalk that attaches the leaf to the stem. You can look here, this stalk. So this stalk is attached to the leaf stem like this. So this stalk is called petiole or we call it as leaf stalk. Now this is a stem. Sometimes they are attached to the branch, sometimes to a stem. So the leaf is attached to a branch or a stem through this stalk. And this stalk is called petiole. This petiole is also called leaf stalk. In some leaves, this petiole is absent. So the leaf arises directly from the stem. But most of the plants, the stalk is present which attaches the leaf to the branch or the stem. The entire green flat part of the leaf is known as lamina or leaf blade. So this green part of the leaf this is called lamina or leaf blade. You can see this flat area. So this is called lamina and lamina is also called as leaf blade. Other name of lamina is leaf blade. The outline of lamina, they are different in different leaves. So this outline of lamina is called leaf margin. And the tip of the leaf, the tip of the leaf, you can see in different leaves, this tip of the leaf is called leaf apex. You can observe that this petiole enters into the lamina at the center as a thick midrib. You can see the center line. This is the midrib. So there is a thick midrib in the center which is the extension of petiole into the lamina. This is called as midrib. You can see this midrib in the center. This line is midrib. And this midrib has branches on both the sides. You can see this. A network of branches are present on both the sides. These branches are known as veins. So from the midrib, branches are there which are known as veins. These veins further have branches which spread in different directions and we call it as veinlets. And these branches, they form a network. So all these midrib, veins and veinlets, they form the, uh, uh, they give a support to the leaf and the conduction of water, minerals and food is carried out with the help of veinlets. So students, today we have studied the parts of a leaf. So let's do it again. The part which joins the leaf to the stem is called petiole or it is called as leaf stalk. The entire green part of the leaf, this flattened structure is called lamina or we call it as leaf blade. This petiole enters into the lamina in the center and it is called as midrib. So this midrib, you can see all the leaves, their basic structure is same. All the leaves, their basic structure is same. So in the center, the midrib is present. And this midrib has the branches going to both the sides called as veins and these veins further form a network called as veinlets. In general, leaves are of two types. Now we are going to start with the types of leaves. They are of two types, simple leaf and 
कंपाउंड लीफ इन सिंपल लीफ देर इज वन कंप्लीट लेमिना और वी कैन से दैट द लेमिना इज नॉट डिवाइडेड इन टू एनी सेगमेंट्स देर इज अ कंप्लीट लेमिना लाइक दिस एग्जाम्पल्स देर मेनी एग्जाम्पल्स लाइक मैंगो बनाना लेमन ग्रेप्स एक्सेट्रा यू कैन सी दीज लीव्स आर सिंपल लीव्स वेयर दे आर नॉट डिवाइडेड इन टू सेगमेंट्स दे वेर एस इन कंपाउंड लीव द लेमिना इज डिवाइडेड इन टू स्मॉलर पार्ट्स दिस दे डू नॉट हैव अ सिंगल लेमिना इट इज डिवाइडेड इन टू स्मॉलर पार्ट्स विच आर कॉल्ड एज लीफलेट्स सो ऑन द बोथ साइड्स ऑफ द मिट्रिप लीफलेट्स आर प्रेजेंट हेयर यू कैन सी दैट द लेमिना इज डिवाइडेड इन टू डिफरेंट पार्ट्स and these sing parts are not called as leaves these are called as leaflets for example we have various examples in your surroundings like acacia neem kadi patta is one of the example rose plant is another example where the leaves are divided into lamina is divided into segments you can see this is kadi patta leaf and these are leaflets we don't call them as leaves we call them as leaflets so students today we have discussed about leaf parts of the leaf and parts of the leaf and types of the leaf that is simple leaf as well as compound leaf so you can collect different leaves from your garden and can observe its structure thank you thank you